Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel and welcome if this is your first time here. My name is Hanna and on this channel I mostly do plus size fashion with a little bit of beauty and lifestyle sprinkled in. So if any of that sounds interesting to you, I hope you subscribe and stick around. Okay, let's see if I still remember how to do this. <laughs> um, it's been a while. Um, I haven't really filmed uh, because um, first I was on holiday um, and after that um, I got sick. So after two years, over two years of avoiding it, the uh, C word <laughs> finally got to me. So I was pretty sick uh, for a few days and um, now I've been um, better, but my voice is still a little bit, it's not like completely back to normal, so my apologies for that. But yeah, uh, it's been a while, but today's video is going to be a Fashion Nova Curve try-on haul. And to be honest, this is probably my last Fashion Nova video for a while, um, and I will let you know why. Um, so basically I have uh, items from two orders that I made. Um, one order I um, placed on the last of May. I placed an order on Fashion Nova and I got express shipping, which should have been seven to nine business days. However, uh, I don't know what happened to that order, but it was like missing in action for a while and uh, Fashion Nova customer service was completely useless. They didn't respond to my messages and when they did, they didn't really have any information. Um, and I contacted the post office and I contacted the, the shipping company and uh, it was a whole mess, but it did finally arrive in the beginning of July. So it took over a month and I paid for express shipping. So that's fun. <laughs> so that was the first order and the second order I actually placed in mid-June, I think. Like about two weeks after I had placed the first order. And the second order I didn't get express shipping and it only took like two weeks for that to arrive. So I actually got the like regular shipping, the order, order where I paid for regular shipping, it was actually here before the one where I paid for express, express shipping. So um, I don't know what's going on with Fashion Nova, but I'm, I'm not gonna buy there for at least a good long while. I'm not gonna buy any of their products because I need to know if I'm paying for express shipping, I need to know that I can actually trust the company to deliver. <laughs> so <clears throat> I don't know what happened, but I'm, I'm taking a little break from Fashion Nova. I still wanted to make the haul because I know that I have a lot of subscribers in uh, in the US and obviously Fashion Nova is a US based company so these issues with shipping probably don't apply uh, if you're in the US. So I think the issue is that they used to deliver to Europe uh, via DHL and they changed the shipping company and I think that's where the issue is. Because DHL Express shipping from uh, Fashion Nova used to be so quick, just like literally a few days and it would be in Finland. So I think this is probably an issue for international customers. So if you live in Finland or in Europe, I would say if you want to order something from this haul, don't pay for Express shipping. Just get regular shipping and uh, prepare to wait a couple of weeks. 
but definitely don't pay for express shipping. And I'm saying this because I have recommended express shipping from Fashion Nova before, but um, they have changed it, so it's no longer good. <laughs> so yeah, something to keep in mind. I still wanted to do the haul since I like a lot of the items, there's nothing wrong with the clothes, it's just the company that I'm kind of iffy with at the moment, because that I didn't really get great customer service from them. So if you want to order from them, um, I will link everything below. I'm not affiliated with them, obviously, in any way, shape or form, but I will link everything down below. And if you order from them and if you are in Europe, just don't pay for express shipping and prepare to wait a while. <laughs> okay, so that's the long story about why this will probably be my last Fashion Nova haul for, for a while. And now we can actually jump into the try-on portion. Let me know in the comments which item was your favorite. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it and remember to subscribe and turn on your notifications. That would mean a lot to me. Share this video with your friends if you think someone might be interested. I would appreciate that as well. Okay, let's move on to the try-on portion now. All right, let's get started with the first dress. Actually, all the items in this haul are dresses. So this is the first one and I think it's really cute. It's a little bit short, but then again, I am tall. So I'm five foot 10 and a half. 179 centimeters tall so a lot of dresses are short on me but I like the print of this it's kind of like a abstract tie-dye but it also looks kind of like camo print it's really interesting and it's this ruched uh, style that Fashion Nova does really well uh, the straps are just basically like uh, strings so uh, you have to have a strapless bra with this but otherwise really cute um, the second dress uh, I really really like this is kind of giving me like Cinderella you know the top top part is very much like the uh, dress that Cinderella wears in the Disney movie uh, so I, I really like this um, the color is beautiful. This does not have any stretch. So I sized up in this and I'm really glad I did because it fits really well, but it's still kind of tight when I sit down because I have bigger hips. So I would definitely recommend if you're interested in this one, do size up because it doesn't have any stretch. But I think it's absolutely beautiful. Um, something I would wear out to dinner or just brunch or something like that. Uh, really pretty and uh, I think it looks very nice on me. Uh, the next dress is a little bit more glam. This is more like an evening dress. Uh, it's very plunging. So all of these dresses, I think almost all of them have adjustable straps which is great so i have tightened the straps as tight as i can but you can still see my bra so i'm not sure what kind of bra i would be able to wear with this one but it's absolutely beautiful like it's this color i don't usually get like brown kind of like a cognac uh, color but I just think it's really stunning. Uh, someone said on TikTok that this is kind of like a Jessica Rabbit dress and I have to agree, it's very glamorous. And this one is also stretchy. So really like that one. Another, uh, maybe a little bit more sexier dress. Uh, this one is definitely one that I will just wear at home for my husband. <laughs> And I actually already wore it uh, on Friday. We had a little bit of a date night at home. So uh, this is very 
short <laughs> it's very short and you can't wear a bra with this uh, it's completely open in the back but I felt really cute in this dress and I like having dresses like this when I just want to feel cute at home I spend a lot of time at home and there's nothing wrong with it you don't have to have not all of your clothes have to be like things to wear out because we do spend most people spend a lot of time at home and it's nice to have some cute at home dresses you don't have to just wear sweatpants <laughs> when you're at home so that was really cute but not something I would wear outside um, this is another shorter dress but it's not as short as the red one and this is really cool it's basically like a neon dress it doesn't the camera doesn't do it justice but it's like this bright kind of uh, pink color that is layered with this sort of neon blue and it gives it a, like a purple effect it has a lot of ruching uh, again Fashion Nova does this mesh ruched dresses really well it gives me a nice shape um, the ruching on the side and on the back is really flattering again it has adjustable straps uh, so yeah I really like this one I'm not sure where I'm gonna wear it uh, I have to go to like a rave <laughs> or something but it's really cool well this one uh, on the other hand was kind of a, a disappointment uh, I was really excited for this like tie-dye maxi dress and I got it in this yellow color but I feel like I should have gone for another color like red or something because this, I think this would look stunning on someone with a deeper skin tone but I'm a little bit too pale and the other thing about this is that it's super super see-through so basically you would have to have like um, underwear that is exactly your skin tone or you need to wear something underneath here I'm wearing a, a pair of like um, nudish uh, color biker shorts uh, so and I just like hitched up the other leg because it has a very high slit but it's a it's not perfect I do like the fact that it's really soft and as you can see it's definitely long like I said I'm tall and it still touches the floor so yeah it's I'm not sure about that one um, however this last one I've been really enjoying I've worn this already for a few times now so this is um, kind of like a cover-up you could wear this over a swimsuit uh, but you can also wear it at home just like this it has really high slits that come up to the waist so I've, I've gone to the store and stuff I just put like a black mini skirt uh, underneath or some biker shorts and you can definitely rock it uh, outside the house as well but I think it would be amazing as a swimsuit cover-up and the colors in this are just absolutely stunning so and it's really comfortable uh, like I said I've worn this already like two or three times uh, so yeah definitely one of my favorites so that was the last item and uh, here you can see the length a little bit better so the length is definitely really good in these longer dresses but that's it for the haul actually so let me know in the comments which item was your favorite uh, and remember to subscribe if you haven't already I hope you have a wonderful day uh, stay safe uh, stay healthy and uh, yeah, uh, I will see you in my next video. Bye.